The first one is an ad-free video player for Android that seems like a filtered version of the infamous MX player because it's not overfilled with lots of non-essential features as the MX player does. And most importantly, it is ad-free. It comes with a bunch of useful features such as gesture support to alter the brightness and volume, video seek by double tapping and swiping, play controls lock, subtitle support, multiple audio support, and an audio equalizer along with background play support so you can watch videos while doing other stuff on your phone. One exclusive feature of this video player is that it lets you browse your media files while you watch videos. All in all, it's one of the best ad-free video players for Android that consumes less battery but the only drawback is that there is no customizable sorting option. All your videos are sorted alphabetically by default and you have to give the app permission to access a specific folder so that the app shows only the media files of the selected folder on the home screen. You can manually play any video through the second tab anyway. The next one is one of the cleanest and easy to use video players for Android. It comes with 5 tabs as you can see. The first tab displays all directories of internal storage, all can be sorted to your liking and you can also pin some of your favorite folders for quick access as well. The second tab is where all your videos can be seen and sorted as you want. The app supports all video formats and offers a bunch of useful features. You get all the required controls on the play screen such as speed control, PIP mode, a sound equalizer, a looper and a handy button to snapshot the video along with the Chromecast facility. A few more features include double tap to pause the video play controls log, multi-audio and subtitle support. That's not it, the app also lets you watch and download online content but it's not working for now. The next tab is where you can see your favorites, downloads, play history and a safe box where you can hide your private videos with a pin. After creating the safe box, go to any video, tap on three dots and click move to the safe box to make them disappear from the home screen. With all these handy features, it seems almost perfect except for the third tab feature. So give it a shot. The next one is a unique video player for Android that lets you watch up to 4 videos at the same time on a single screen. All you need to do is launch the app, tap multiplayer, choose the collage layout, then select the videos you wanna watch and then hit done to open up the play screen. Here you can play all of them at once mute or unmute volumes of each video individually, fast forward or rewind each video by tapping on these arrows individually and you can even switch the video's positions as shown. The app even allows you to change the video layouts as shown on the go. It also supports picture in picture mode but only one video can be played in the background. All in all, it's not a feature rich video player but it does what it says but the major drawback is too many ads. But don't worry, you can block them with this simple trick. Just go to your phone settings, search for private DNS, select private DNS host name, type this and save it. That's it. From now onwards, ads on almost all apps will be blocked. The last but certainly not the least one is your default video player. Let's take the Samsung video library for example, which has made great progress over the years. It's nothing less than any premium video player that plays just about everything and offers all the essential features a video player must have. One unique feature it offers is the instant player. This feature starts playing a video in a small window when you tap on it instead of directly going into the full screen mode. Somewhat like YouTube showing you the preview of the video without moving away from the list of the videos. In addition, you get all the basic features such as play speed control, multi audio support, subtitle support, a screenshot button, a play control lock, a GIF maker etc. And most of the stock apps are ad free so give your stock video player a shot before switching to something else. Well those are some of the best ad free video players for android to try in 2023. I hope you found the video informative, leave a like if you did. Comment down your favorite best video player for Android and subscribe to the channel for more informative videos. Thanks for watching.